Sabe o que acontece com a cabeça dessa mina Quando a música começa a tocar Quando a menina cai o samba Fica feito uma criança Ela não quer mais saber de parar Hey everyone, my name is Jai. The content of our video today is how to make a calculator using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Let's go guys. Let's get started. We will start with HTML, Sublime Text Editor, which we will use to write our codes, because we are used to it. Notepad++ is also good. This is our style, or CSS, its uses for the design of elements and templates. Next is our JavaScript function. Our first function is to format our values with the commas, when the numbers are over 1000. The second JavaScript function is to get the input value of our users, so that we can pass it to our input text box. These are the clicks on the buttons with the number. The third JavaScript function is our computation of the input value of our users. Clicking our equal sign button to make the total appear. Later we will show how to execute this function. We use a built-in function of JavaScript named eval function. What is a val function in JavaScript? A val function is a function property of a global object. The argument of the eval function is a string. If the string represents an expression, a val function evaluates the expression. If the argument represents one or more JavaScript statements, a val function evaluates the statements. The example computation, using the built-in JavaScript eval function, to the input values of our users. A val function will take care of the correct answer for the whole total. An example is like this, a val function. Then the input value is a string of 150 plus 200. The eval function will work for you to get the correct answer of 350, before we pass the correct answer to our object element. Let's call the first JavaScript function we created, which is to commas for it to be formatted. The last but not the least, JavaScript function we created, is the clear function, just to remove all the inputs of our users. In our HTML we use tables for the alignment of our clickable buttons. We have mathematics operations, and those numbers 0 to 9 and the equal button, to make our calculator work. I think we are done with our calculator. Let's try the output, but before we run the output of our calculator, let's commercial first. Let's watch it. Just enter, in your web browser URL, www.jsoft2001.com so you can see below, the list of great web hosting services. For those looking for web hosting there, please come. Because you have many options here. Just a reminder, there are running ads on this website, so just ignore it. Just close the pop-ups that appear on the screen. I would recommend, for you Green Geeks web hosting services, besides being fast, secure it is also cheap. If you are looking for web hosting for your website, here it is. Many more. This too, the WPX hosting, check this out. Watch out for those with promos. Like this. Best wishes sale only $1.89 per month.
like let's run the output, the calculator we made. We will also put in the video description, the source code link in the exercise.